Knight dumps it inside to Chelsea Gardner with a power dribble. Turn around, baby hook is good for Chelsea Gardner. To Hawkins, now Williams at the free throw line. Left side, Natalie Knight, head fakes, drives in, kicks it out to Harper for a high arcing three. Swish, CC Harper. So Kansas with the ball, trailing by five. Still working against that 2-3 zone. Inside Chelsea Gardner, double team there, but she had a deep catch, misses the shot. Bunny Williams rips down the rebound and powers it back up and in. Now Bradford steps into a three. This one misses long. Rebound Natalie Knight for KU. I think they'll give up that shot to Bradford. Ahead to Hawkins, driving in on Bradford. Lays it up and in, and a blocking foul. 17.45 to go. Jayhawks looking for their first lead of the second half. Knight open for three on the right wing. She hit it! Central Michigan leads it, 18.50 to go. Knight, short corner to Gardner. That's her shot, and she knocks it down. Ahead to Hawkins, and now to Harper. Still a three-point KU lead. Hawkins gets around one defender, driving baseline, layup off the glass is good. We weren't very focused and didn't have much energy, but then, you know, proud of them to kind of, because you got to you got to own your own energy, and you got to, and I said, we got to change the momentum, guys. They're not, we got to be able to change it. I, I thought overall big minutes. Bunny was good early. I mean, she got us back in the game. She had the two offensive rebound putbacks, I think, to get it to a one possession game. So, in that, there are a lot of kids that made, made plays when you're talking about a one possession game. You get a little bit of time to go enjoy Thanksgiving and yeah. then get right back at it tomorrow against Xavier. Yeah, we will. We'll meet tonight, go through Xavier, who's a really talented team who played well against Duke today. And a, kind of five out motion team who shoots a three and play some two three as well uh, and we haven't seen them trap as much as we have with central michigan but yeah we've got our hands full tomorrow as well